Okay, here's an example of a physical pendulum problem. We did this one in class, so it's kind of review. And so again, we're making a physical pendulum out of a rod, but physical pendulum could be anything, even you. Uh, you hold really still. So anything that's pivoting back and forth is a physical pendulum. And we derived the period in the previous one. And so this is not on the equation sheet. You should know how to come up with it. Uh, it is okay to put it on your calculator in your calculator memory. It might come in handy if you know what it is, but you will need to show one way or another how you got it. You get full credit. So in this case, I is rotational inertia about the pivot point, not about the center. So we would need the parallel axis theorem to get the rotational inertia. And the rotational inertia of a rod about its center is 1 12th ml squared. And so that's what we'll use in I. So I is always going to be using parallel axis theorem for a physical pendulum because if it was rotating about its center, it'd just spin. It wouldn't oscillate back and forth. There'd be no torque to bring it back. So we set the period equal to two and a half seconds. We want to solve for H and the rotational inertia is 1 12th ML squared, where L is 1. It's a meter stick in this case. And uh, H is the same H as here. H is the distance from the center to the rotation axis. And so that's the H in the parallel axis theorem and the H in the denominator of the period equation. And so we simplify, the mass goes, and we put L equal 1. It's not always 1, so just be careful with that. And if we multiply that out, uh, I divided both sides by 2 pi. Um, and uh, squared both sides and you can see you get a quadratic and we solve for H and you get two positive answers which should we pick? Well you can see clearly from the drawing here uh, and the fact that we're have a hole in the meter stick it's got to be this. This would be off the meter stick. Uh, it is true uh, that if you were to hang the meter stick from a long string and if this distance was 1.495 meters, it would have a two and a half second period, which is kind of cool.